Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another episode. Today we are going to go check out an old AMC theater here in Jacksonville before they go ahead and tear it down. So follow along and uh, we'll go ahead and check it out. inside this movie theater and as you see it just opens up into the massive concession room you can see where they would have had the old movie posters hung up and then you've got all the old concession stands as you can see a bunch of the soda fountains are actually still up there which is insane. Looks like you've got some old kitchen cleaner, a beer, and then it looks like the customer service booths right there. And that is the front of this place. Now, as you can see, oh, there's another guest services and then just another massive concession booth. And it looks like it does have the pretzel warmer still. It's actually got quite a bit of kitchen equipment left in here still. I'm surprised. I'm surprised they did not take any of that before wanting to demo this place. Now you can see right here is where the ticket windows used to be. So here's this back kitchen. Again, like I said, they kept a bunch of supplies in here still. I can't believe they are not pulling any of this stuff out before they knock this place down. I mean, that's an expensive stainless cabinet right there. As you can see, they still have some of the old signs here as well. And my favorite part of coming to the movie theaters, especially when I came with my parents when I was younger, was that machine right there. That is a good old slushy machine. I'm a cherry kind of guy, cherry Fanta. As you can see, they've already started the demolition process. We're actually on the second floor. This is where they used to have a bunch of the bunch of the monitors to play the movies on. I'll go ahead and show you what I'm talking about here. You can see a bunch of the computers and stuff they use to project all the monitors. And that's just one of the few abandoned theaters in this place. We'll keep working our way around one of the smaller theaters of this Theater. Looks like there's another upstairs. We'll go ahead and check that out real quick. And we've just got another big massive open room. It looks like it goes to one of the big theaters they've got here. Oh yeah. That is a massive theater. 
And with the massive theater comes a massive electrical system as well. And we made it up onto the roof, guys. This is looks like obviously where all the AC units are housed and stuff. We'll just work our way back down. All right, so we're gonna walk into the theater areas where all the movie theaters would have been. Going to this one right here. As you can see, all the seats are left still. It's got the big screen, all the speakers. It's still a fully intact movie theater. Let's go ahead and get a shot from up top. All right, and we'll keep working our way around. Go ahead and check out one more theater in here. As you can see, it's one of the smaller theaters, but again, everything is fully intact. Still got all the screens, the speakers, and it even looks like there's an old McDonald's bag. This is crazy. You can see all the mold growing. So we're at the back of the theater now. Still has all its water fountains intact. And as you can see, this Florida moisture has not been nice to this building. Lots of mold growing in here. Still got the original carpet. And then this looks like one of the maintenance rooms. Oh yeah. Still got a bunch of cleaning supplies left behind. That and even, I mean, even that cabinet. I mean, that's an expensive cabinet. I cannot believe they're about to demo this place with that cabinet in there. But look at that wall. Absolutely just blasted with mold. Let's go ahead and check one of these bathrooms out. Looks like it's still fully intact. It's got the checkerboard tile. Still got all of the hand dryers too. This brings back so many memories. I remember going to movie theaters when I was younger and it really was a fun time, but now everything's just streamed on Amazon and places like that. So that's why a lot of these theaters are closing down. COVID did not do them a good number. Now here's the back side of this building. This place has been abandoned for a while, as you can tell by the graffiti. And there's also been a lot of companies here that are just dumping trash everywhere, which is a shame. I used to own a landscape company and we did a lot of tree work. If you guys have extra debris, don't dump it at abandoned spots. That's ridiculous. Go take it to the dump. It's really not that expensive.
But one thing I never noticed that these movie theaters have, they have rat traps. It says poison, do not touch. Look at the little holes they've got on both sides. Never realized that. Again, more debris. And that concludes this tour, guys. Thanks for joining me on this trip. If you guys liked the video, please hit the like and subscribe button below. And I appreciate your support. Tune in next week for my next abandoned tour. Thanks, and you guys have a great day. Bye.